You may have heard recently about the artificial intelligence program ChatGPT. Some University of Minnesota law professors wanted to find out just how smart it is. They wanted to know if it could pass their final exams. Adam Duxter shares how the results are surprising the professors and students alike. Professor Dan Schwartz had his doubts. The questions that we ask on law school exams are not, you know, tell me when this law was passed, or not, not the types of things you could ask Google. But as he graded his students' exams, he genuinely couldn't tell which one. It organizes the answers. Was a student. First, dollar is liability for David's injury. Or the AI program ChatGPT. This tool is amazingly powerful. Powerful enough to pass with a C plus. It's a passing grade at a really very good law school. Our students are really excellent. And it's a passing grade to very difficult questions. It's, it's all over Twitter, it's all over social media. Everybody, you know, is posting about it in group chats, stuff like that. Students like Brian Gatter couldn't believe it. The part that almost surprised me is that it only got a C plus, right? Every show, like the Jetsons, that's that's the whole point is that you know we're supposed to get replaced by robots at some point. I felt fine because it was on the low end of the curve. Let's go back and look at how I see. Schwartz says now it's on teachers to make sure it's not a tool used to cheat. It has immense power to, I, I think, revolutionize many fields. But rather think of ways it could be used for good. AI can't just write a brief. It can't just, you know, write a will. Um, but what it can do is be a useful tool. Professor Schwartz says in the long run, artificial intelligence likely won't end up replacing attorneys, but helping them. As for if it could replace someone like me, a reporter. Uh, well, I don't know about that. We'll have to see. <laughs> well, Adam Duxter, WCCO 4 News, for now. The research is presented in a 16-page report called Chat GPT Goes to Law School. According to the report, despite the C-plus grade, the AI did exceed in some areas of the test while struggling in others. 99% of students who pass that test do pass the bar.